Silence, but do fast. One, two, three. Fast, say do fast. Look around you. One, two, three. from the back yang belakang ni yang I belum ajar lagi sebab dia apa beyond D ah eh okey there eh please okey What is this? Huh? L-O-T? Not To Discover But last year, he was not so into reading He was more on memorizing and reciting This year, bawa I was on reading yeah? So I choose another one So Which one do you like most? Okay, do you like this one? Ini semua kita tak jumpa lagi di sini. Di sini sama satu pun ya. Loud and clear. Louder lah. Kita nak tengok video. Okay, louder. Okay. Day. Mm. Okay. And blue. You know why? Because the first time I introduced this one to them, I make them color their fingers. Ah, uh, so they are the color red and green, yellow and blue, purple and pink, brown and orange too. Mix some black with some white, you will get grey, that's right. Ah, that's why they do like, you will get grey, that's right, okay? So I make, I color their fingers. Jadi, dia orang, dia orang ingat, jari mana, ah. That is one thing about kids, they remember. Walaupun dah tak ada, bayang-bayang hijau tu nampak dekat mata dia kat situ. Bayang-bayang hijau tu nampak dalam hidup dia. Sebab dia tak ada banyak benda ingat, kita cerita kan? Okay? So high frequency words. So these are the high frequency words that we can get from this one rhyme. So for example, in this context, in this book, if you can see, uh, the children has circled the word you, Y O U, as in orange. So till the end, yeah, kalau cikgu tengok buku ni sekarang, ada dua high frequency words yang sangat ketara, which is U and A N D and. So if you notice, the word U is circled with orange, the word N is circled with pink. And it will be circled the same way till the end of the book. Every time they jump and they can what pink. 
Every time dia jumpa you dia akan buat orange. Sampailah habis. This is what self access learning. So sometimes macam infant tadi tu. Dia smart tapi dia ada masalah dia. Masalah dia ialah kesia, boring, nak anak, tak suka 6 tahun, suka 5 tahun. Sebab 5 tahun dia dia main. 5 tahun dia datang sekolah, hai bagi dia main. Orang lain belajar, hai bagi dia main sekejap. Dia macam dah kena kena huruf, hai bagi dia aktiviti main. Sebab 6 tahun nak nak serius membaca ni. So dia cakap kat hai, 5 tahun best, pas sekolah banyak main. Sekarang kena belajar dia. And then dia dah cepat sikit pula sebab dia 2 tahun dekat kelas sekolah tu. Dia macam dah, dah ingat semua. Kecuali yang tadi beyond of, yang tu dah belakang sangat dia tak ingat lah. Okay? Jadi dia macam, the, the thing is, mula-mula ingat dia, dia hafal. Lepas tu bila I point the words here and there, I notice that he he knows the words. And the best part is he understands the word as well. Like tadi dia, what is brother, what is nice, what is busy, dia boleh jawab. Uh, dia boleh jawab. And when Madam Jo did that, that's it. Madam Jo did ask him one by one what is the meaning of the word and so on. That's why Madam Jo thinks that we should <coughs> share this among you guys. Yeah? So, those are high frequency words. The similar sounds, yeah? for example, okay, look at this line. <laughs> Bus and car, bicycle and lorry, sampan and boat, ship and ferry. Dalam satu rhyme ni saja, satu paragraph ni saja, we can get like uh, eight nama-nama uh, kenderaan, betul? Yes. Lapan, okay? So this is why one one of the kuatan rhymes ni ialah, what we want the, we want the vocabulary, kan? <coughs> the most important thing is we want the vocabulary, right? So in this rhyme, memang dah ada 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 12 nama-nama uh, kenderaan yang nak kita nak introduce as early as preschool, eh? So bus and car, bicycle and lorry, sampan and boat, ship and ferry. Okay, let's say, let's say we blank the ferry. Bus and car, bicycle and lorry, sampan and boat, ship and dash. So what will be the answer? Kita buat quiz dengan kanak-kanak. Strawberry, curry, Ferry Sari ha, Yang mana? Sari ha, Kalau budak jawab sari ha, Sounds similar But is it correct? No No Why? The answer is Ferry Why ferry? Semua tu similar sounds Tapi kenapa ferry? Because we are talking about Transport, Transport. So untuk kita mudah lah But for, ki for kids kan Benda tu macam Higher order thinking skills Okay? So all of those given answers are similar sounds But the answer is very Why? Because we are talking about transport yeah? And team based learning Macam kita buat ni ha, contohnya This drawing yeah? uh, And then cutting pictures yeah? All those are team based learning We can do drama yeah? I used to do drama with my preschool kids And presented it uh, to the state level new program So dapat jemputan untuk drama bahasa Inggeris lah my class yeah? Okay so, uh, reading, read simple words. I'm sure you have these uh, skills in your curriculum as well. Read simple words, read phrases, read simple sentences. So, that's really valid interest in reading. Yeah? The whole idea is, kita bukan ajar dia membaca sebab dia pandai, tak pandai baca. Kita nak ajar dia baca, satu suruh dia pandai baca. Yang kedua, kita nak suruh dia minat membaca. And that is why the element of fun is very important. Once they know reading, they know how to read, they stop reading. So, Dia tak pandai baca, tak boleh tak, tak membaca dah lepas tu Our objective kita capai tak untuk jangka panjang we, Kalau if you want a civilized citizen We need them to read They love to read kan? As we know, our Malaysian read only like two books uh, per year ya. Kan? Kita punya per capita which is very far from Japan 36 books per year, ya? one person read okay? So writing, consolidation of understanding We can do any activities ya. Kalau tengok smart students, we buat word maze, word puzzle Fill in the blanks, read up range ya. So, kalau tidak pun buat tracing sahaja eh? Teacher recites Children recite after teacher If you notice, eh, masa ni kelas I kosong lagi Sebab ini adalah tahun-tahun awal I mengajar prasekolah And they come and observe me eh? uh, I haven't completed my classroom Tadi cikgu kuasa tak kelas I ada banyak Kataan kan uh, I, know, but I memang banyak bagi dui bahasa punya words Dalam kelas I Supaya bila berlaku self-access learning They can move around and do their work they will be talking but they are doing their work yeah? Children say with correct pronunciation Teacher shows action Children do action okay, This is another time people come and observe Okay, That is one more thing I would like to explain to you yeah? 
LEA is language experience approach. Now, for example, we have recite the whole rhyme about food, yeah? And then we make them sit in front. As I told you, the master that told you, they sit in front and talk back. Okay, in the rhyme food just now, what are the names of food that you learn? Apa nama makanan yang you learn just now? Porridge. Okay, the children tulis porridge. Okay, nampak macam simple cikgu kan? Dia sebut porridge, kita tulis porridge. But imagine cikgu, seorang kanak-kanak, jawapan dia bagi, teacher tulis kat whiteboard. Benda tu besar pada dia. You know, for example, you come to a course, I tanya you, Eh, what is PLC ya? Orang lain semua tak tahu, tiba-tiba you seorang je tahu, professional learning community. Macam kembang juga kan, sebab dia seorang je tahu kan? Macam, eh, saya seorang je tahu jawapan. Okay, so that feeling kanak-kanak pun ada. The answer given by them is written on the board eh? I uh, don't be surprised budak akan jawab and orange and cereal kan? And and is not a food and is high quality words kan? Okay. The writing activities. Writing is not necessary writing. Mm. Writing activities ni dalam prasekolah ada dua. 4.1 is engaged with uh, N and I coordination ya. Yeah? 4.2 baru pegang pencil and making lines, making circles, writing alphabets, all those things. So when it is about engaged in N and I coordination, it can be cutting. Pasting, scribbling, yeah. Renyukkan semua, everything can be under uh, writing activities, okay? So this is uh, this is also my lucky time. Uh, uh, someone came and observed me, uh, and uh, I was doing this activity. This is less about going to recycle things, kan? I mean, the jayu, the flyer, set. Okay, this is one part yang Nazir itu sangat sangat suka. Dia I make my 25 students each and every one. Go to the front and say the sentence. Let's say I like to eat apple, I like to eat chocolate, I like to eat cakes. I like this not just I like to eat something. I place at the board. I like to eat. They they look cakes. Whatever they like, I like to eat cheese. They look cakes. Cheese. They play cheese. The words are all over the class, eh? And under the lamb rings, porridge, ni contohnya porridge pula, food ni. Okay. Dalam rhyme food ni dia ada banyak nama-nama makanan So kita dah hajar kat sini Nak, nak, nak jadi cerita saya lah nasib, nasib saya Kita dah hajar ni So benda ni dah ada dalam otak dia Nazir datang and I was doing a reading activity on that day So I make each and every one go to the front and pick their sentence I like to eat ice cream, I like to eat uh, chicken, I like to eat chocolate, I like to eat pizza Whatever lah Kalau benda tu ada dekat sini dia boleh copy the sentence je uh, Contohnya cereal, ada lukis je lah cereal kan Ada yang tak ada dalam ni, contohnya cheese Ada budak ni dia buat cheese uh, I spell for him lah See, Sebab kebetulan dalam kelas I pun tak ada gambar cheese Then I spell for him See, Dia kata teacher, I suka makan keju What is keju? Keju is in cheese in English So as I spell the word for him, he write down yeah? So this boy uh, So I like to eat cheese, I like to eat grapes and So each and every one of them go to the front and say the sentence So nampak macam mudah kan, tapi Giving chance to each and every student go to the front and doing presentation is a big thing for kids. Then speaking in English pula tu, even though one sentence. Okay? Ha. Tapi sebenarnya mudah tak nak buat benda ni? Bukanlah susah sangat sebenarnya kan? Kalau kita kata semua semua orang kena baca, bunyi macam mana boleh baca di air pun tak mana. Actually tak baca pun. Dia pergi depan dia, I like to read chicken rice. The word I like to read, dengar 25 kali, dapat tak dalam kotak dia? I like to to eat, sorry, I like to eat something Dapatlah kan, and then dia dapat 25 nama makanan pada hari itu Kecuali ada redundant lah, dua orang cakap chicken rice ke, okay? So this is alphabet rhymes activities, ni I dah terangkan earlier So this is where, okay, see the, the colouring part, ya yeah? So they colour accordingly, ya, yeah, to the earlier picture ha, Nampak macam mana, jadi dia colour tu ada maksud lah, ya yeah? Oh, ni yang I buat sharing dengan Linus teachers Oh, ni Cik Kamarudin Ah, yes, Cik Kamarudin Oh, this one, this computer, kataan ni semua lari-lari lah, okay? Alright Ini lah saya buat dengan teman Linus, Cik Kamarudin Oh, lah sepuluh lah, bantai Okay, once they are done with the rhyme part They go and do their mind map eh? Satu teacher dah ajar dah, J is for jelly Now go and find two more so the girl decided to take jellyfish and jug Ada lagi jaguar ada dalam kelas tu kan Dapat apa je lah tu So tapi kelas kita kena ada macam ni lah Ataupun dekat satu meja sudut yang ada banyak card kan But with students you can ask them to open dictionary 
ada picture dictionary kan ha. Okay, when I do when I did my research ni I, I this is the supporting uh, quotes that I presented so in fact rhymes and rhythms are instrumental in helping children remember words and research has linked difficulty in picking up rhyming words with difficulty in learning to read yeah and children who are read to three times a week do much better in later development than children who are read to less than three times a week so the importance of reading why ya yeah? bila kita baca dia tak pandai baca but why it is important because they are listening Macam cikgu cakap lah, bila dia masuk kelas, bila cikgu sebut eyes What is open? Open makan I'm sure none of my students will say open to makan So every day I say, okay dah open ni ya, abu Kalau dia kata makan, mereka tutup dengan buku tu lah <laughs> So every day I use the language So you encourage your preschool teachers to do this Routine language to do in Bahasa Inggeris Bahasa Melayu dia dah pandai Betul tak? Tak payah buat dah Do all the routine language to do in English So my children, they need to memorize this sentence Three sentences. Kalau dia nak survive dalam kelas I, may I, may I drink water? May I go to toilet? Can Can I play? Cukup percaya tak? Most of the students will take three days to memorize this. Yang susah susah sangat tu adalah teacher may I wah wah water? Nak drink water? Ya, tapi lantaklah wah wah water pun lantaklah kan? Try this best kan? So teacher may I go to toilet? Tiga hari je tu. Emphasize three sent three sentences. They have to memorize if they want to survive Sebab siapa tak nak main Once you are done with your work You want to play, yes? But you must come and tell me Teacher, can I play blocks? Teacher, can I play door? Teacher, can I play whatever? Pas lain pun tak apa Tapi can I play? Congkak ke? Tak kisah Tapi dia kena cakap dengan I Teacher, can I play something? Lepas tu dia kena cakap Teacher, campur boleh? <laughs> campur cakap ada Campur blocks ada Boleh je lah Tapi I make them survive dengan three sentences yang wajib tu Then the rest I I conduct everything in English They will respond to the language even though they don't speak Most of the time they don't speak lah kan macam But then I say, now let's try position, they know their position I got to get closer, they know how to get closer Sit down, cross your legs, put your finger on your lips They tahu semua tu All the best in their sick routines eh? Put your water at the corner Sit down and drink your water, dia tahu Line up, queue up Group leader stand up Assistant come here, ha, tahu semua tahu Yang tu lah, the best, best language Because I use it every time, not only for English session So I remember my days, my school days Cikgu Bahasa Inggeris ni memang muka dia garam Tahu, dia keluar Cikgu Bahasa Inggeris takkan cakap Melayu Dekat MGS, Cikgu Bahasa Inggeris takkan cakap Melayu Memang objek itu seperti Cambridge Kita cakap bahasa Inggeris Dengan dia kalau nak survive Ingat lagi dia Tak cakap macam itu nak ayat aku Tak kena beri aku tu kan uh, Kalau luar waktu pendidikan kan Luar waktu MP kita nak Kita nak bercakap dengan cikgu tu nak minta apa-apa tu We have to let Check my sentence correct or not Because I talk to that There's a segment ke apa tu kan Cuma boleh nak kan Okay, correct okay. Check your grammar Cikgu tu kalau aku salah <laughs> Dua masa tu jenam, jenam jenam lah kan Orang MGS tahu lah <laughs> Those days cikgu bahasa Inggeris MGS image dia memang macam tu Okay so I'm trying to give a little bit of image Untuk budak-budak I If you want to survive with me We have to speak this with friends Rather than that adalah kalau nak mengadu Teacher tadi yang masuk kelas dia Teacher Irfan kata dia bodoh Teacher orang ni kata dia gila Orang semua ada Maksudnya kan buat laporan Buat banyak-banyak lebar Buat laporan Dia suka sangat ada dari cikgu tu Kawan dengan adik yang kembar tu Anak pegawai PD Linus tau PD Linus buat tak Yang kepal korang tu ada satu dua tu Yang cakap pun tak pandai Cakap betak lagi pun Tapi dia dah boleh A is for Apple, B is for Bird Dah boleh kenal dah Yang duduk dekat cik Yang you duduk dekat dia orang tadi tu Haa 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 Okay, any question, Cikgu? Ada soalan? Ah, tadi Cikgu tu tanya 
dia kata for me it's easier lah sebab dia duduk kat orang daripada pagi sampai balik kan hmm. so the whole session is mine the the, the classroom is my territory kan yes, yes. Ha, very true enough lah kan mana cikgu keluar masuk keluar masuk and then different classes apa semua kan so <laughs> so maybe i don't know do you think that this methodology is going to work in your classroom do you find this methodology interesting and helping ke i don't know uh, Cikgu, cikgu, cikgu. 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 Cikgu, c
kalau ada 25 tu kita boleh hmm. nampak semua orang less than 30 yeah. lah kan yeah, at least 30 lah maknanya kita nak decorate kelas pun maknanya the environment the uh, ambience yeah, masih dalam friendly, friendly lah yes. friendly for us to touch yes. here and there yes. and, uh, I can tell that you, I cannot fight for you guys I mean, please go Because I'm a sibuk, I'm a business orang pula kan So, but I can tell that you, these are the things that uh, Cik Cik Lain, they used to say this lah Bila Bila Abi, Sherry memang ingin antara masalahnya Yang kedua, dia kata, Cik Cik Lain macam tak nak expose dengan bahasa Inggeris The year one teacher macam kena buat kerja prasekolah bagi yeah. And ramai juga yang tak kenal guru, I'm quite surprised lah yang tak kenal guru Sebab tak habis tahun dekat Perang takkan tak kenal guru I mean, I pun tak produce 25 out of 25, 100% tak because I'm not a magician, I'm a teacher Ada juga satu dua yang Tak habis A sampai Z Tapi basically 23 out of 24 23 out of 25 tu Lepas lah kan? ha, Lepas lima setelah macam tu Lepas lah maknanya But I dengar juga rumputan dari pegawai kata Haa sekolah pemerintah aku ni polis yang paling teruk sekali lah So kan ha. So which is my colleagues juga Macam 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 you nak pergi tu Pergi tu anyone kan you ada module macam ada pengajaran kan jadi uh, your student menulis tak atas buku biasa menulis kau baru kau tunjuk kat you ya uh, ada uh, single line uh, uh, tapi the last stage first alphabet rhymes and then thematic rhymes habis ni uh, dah pandai baca I akan buat macam buku communication tadi buku communication book belakang tu dia akan tulis tanpa kalau buku cerita tapi that one is writing title only I have another book for them to write uh, words according to things Ha, contohnya ni kan colors kan Contohnya ni colors So they list down balik semua colour-colour yang dia belajar ha, And then shapes, they list down balik the shapes ha. Kan? Ayah tengok ni nampaklah Chinese boy 
uh, pada I nampak terus lah imej tu I tak tahu lah sebab I dia tak pandai lukis pun uh, So tu I nampak cantik, mungkin orang yang pandai lukis tengok Ya saja kan uh, Tapi for me, a six years old punya child doing this uh, I rasa yes, I, 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 I rasa macam tu juga sebab Sebab uh, that's why bila I hampir satu-satu exercise I cakap okay teacher I'm finished okay Now you buatlah corak apa you can just I, I nak trace ada tak yang pandai melukis Sebab dia kan sudah pula dia sendiri tu Because sometimes kita nampak uh, creativity is very betul, betul. subjective uh-huh. Because sometimes bila kita ajar biasa You cannot, yeah, cannot, cannot detect You cannot detect the, the creativity Bila kita kita ada language arts okay? Bila yeah, kita yeah. ada language arts Sometimes kita tengok budak ni Dia dah akan diam je Tapi bila kita bagi dia melukis Dia suka Dia akan yes. buat dengan cantik That's why I prefer my my students to draw anything at the bottom of their book uh-huh. So my teacher kata, kenapa awak suka suka budak awak lukis? So by, by that I boleh nampak oh Dia pandai lukis yes. so, At the same time, kita boleh develop lukis skills And they compare their drawings You know, sometimes dia okay, cantik awak lukis Betul, 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 betul. Yeah, Because, you know, sebab sekarang ni kita 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 banyak Terlalu exam oriented Yes, exam oriented But as, as a preschool teacher, my job is not only teaching them academic wise My job is also to unlock their potential, yeah. make them understand that they they also have some yeah. some strengths. Yeah, yes. bukan ni mungkin pandai baca, but I'm good in drawing. Bukan ni mungkin pandai uh, mengira, but she's good in reciting. Uh, and everyone feels that they are good in everything. That is why you know, for the past eight years, uh, without fail, yeah, every graduation yoga and prasekolah tu, I'll make sure 25 upon 25 go to the stage and present. Even though jadi pak pacak pegang muka mangga pun. They will do their part on the stage Because I know Maybe that is the first and last the next stage Budak tak pandai berapa kali next stage Dah tentu tak terima ayah Persembahan dah tentu tak pandai Wakil sekolah dah tentu tak pandai Kan? So I will make sure 25 out of 25 Naik atas petas Pegang macam ni pun tak boleh Pegang muka mangga tu tak ada Malaysia kan? Sebab kita tahu kita pergi kan? Orang kanan dia pergi Orang kanan dia pergi Kini kanan ada juga Yang momentum tak sama dengan manusia kan? Yang lambat detik tu Ya lambat, itu kan? Ha. So make them goyang macam ni ke Ada je lah jadi, jadi pokok ke, jadi apa ke Tapi dia jadi sesuatu atas pantas Sebab children's potential are different kan? Eh? Ha. Okay So Pakaran tari dah siap dah? Dah? So okay ha, Dalam handout cikgu tu ada satu lagi Cut shapes tu Okay Kenapa saya datang dengan uh, yang macam ni Sebab hari tu masa saya bagi khusus dekat Saya datang dekat BTKN Dia Yelah benda ni 4 ratus setengah Kalau nak suruh cikgu pergi Bawa cikgu datang kos Ada kemungkinan cikgu tak Sebab dia ni tak sampai next week pada semua orang So kita Kita orang Decide bersama-sama dengan A few jabatan people and friends So kita kata kita buat 20 ringgit punya barang Yang everyone can afford to Seberap supaya Metodologi ni pergi pada semua orang Then if you want to buy You buy If you don't want to buy Pun no obligation lah kan But then at least my dad, my part is that I dah share my my module to you Then it's, it's up to you lah Kalau you nak beli later on ke you nak, Ada orang nak beli sendiri Ada orang nak beli tu sekolah Betul-betul itu tak ada satu you Ada orang nak beli tapi kusah tak bagi Ada tak apalah tu My message dah sampai Okay So this uh, four cards ni You boleh laminate and letak dekat sudut bahasa Inggeris Okay And then you can photostate the shapes tu Yang kertas photostate Colors tu shapes Sebelah dia ada shapes kan Yang kertas handak putih tu Ada shapes kan uh, So uh, cuba cikgu buatlah dengan murid cikgu Saya tak nak tunjuk cikgu jontik kat sini Cikgu recite the rhyme and make them draw the 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 thing ni kan Okay and then uh, see whether benda ni menarik minat dia orang ke They can recognize the the shapes ke kan uh, And then benda ni letak dekat sudut bahasa Inggeris kan Dia orang can, can do some activities Finding the same shapes, different colors and so kan Kita lewat dari orang lah Okay Ada soalan cikgu You want to buy the books, so you know how much is the books? Let's try this book. Yeah, cool. ah, yes. Okay, Cikgu, actually, I don't sell this book. This book dekat classroom, I don't pakai sebab I still have one. Okay, so I, I print for them. Sebab apa yang suka buku? Sebab kalau kertas, masuk file. Yeah. I kan sepenuh, sepenuh masa kat sana. Jadi, I suka pagi-pagi, kalau macam kita dah sekarang, kita orang dah sampai water. Kita orang dah sampai top, top water. So, pagi-pagi, I suka buka balik dia pada Ingat tak sama benda kecil kita ngaji, baca daripada Alif. Ya, macam tu saya buat konsep macam tu Baca balik daripada orientation way, colors, shapes And then sampai ke water balik Yang akhir baru kita nak topi baru, sand So this week we are going to talk about sand 
Okay, let's play sand. What is the sand? Okay, what's the text? Okay. That's why I like both. But for selling purpose, you want to do a tablet. That you can also stay. You can also make it into a book or you can call the supplier to get Provided you get the module first. Then only you can buy the book. So, but the whole idea is if you buy the book and you do not use as it is, as it is meant to be done, you won't achieve the objective. The book is more than you can you must get the modules. If you get the module, you don't get the book, you will go to the state and be here again. You can talk to your panitia, get the module. And you get the module, but so you want you want professional sharing dalam kumpulan you. Dalam kumpulan bahasa Inggeris, you panggil cikgu pera sekali buat. The module. The book you must get when you get the, the module. Um, if you buy the module, you can get the books from the supplier. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't study curriculum year one, year two, year three. Tapi according to Kementerian uh, Kebidikan, this one works well for the level one. In fact, ada cik, ada ada dari rahmi sahabat-sahabat sahabat rahmi sahabat, 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 dipakai untuk sahabat jenam sebab so, itu jenam ni pun tak bagus pakai jenam ni Cikgu, you dah tulis dah belum? Belum tulis dah. 